dental growth is closely linked to overall development, so studying it can help us understand how human ancestors evolved. Researchers measured enamel growth rates in Homo antecessor, Homo heidelbergensis, Neanderthals, and early Homo sapiens. Their findings show that early Homo sapiens had the same dental development as modern humans, while Homo antecessor and Homo heidelbergensis had shorter growth periods. Surprisingly, Neanderthals had the shortest dental growth period, meaning they developed faster than their ancestor, Homo heidelbergensis, despite having large brains. This suggests Neanderthals had a unique reversed growth pattern, distinguishing them clearly from Homo sapiens. Recent studies provide insights into Neanderthal development, particularly concerning brain growth patterns. A well-preserved Neanderthal child skeleton from El Cidron, Spain, estimated to be about 7.7 .7 years old at death, revealed that his brain had reached approximately 87.5% of the average adult Neanderthal brain size. In contrast, modern human children at the same age typically achieve about 95% of their adult brain volume. This suggests that Neanderthal brains developed more slowly than those of Homo sapiens. Additionally, research indicates that Neanderthal neonates had brain sizes similar to modern human newborns, implying comparable obstetric constraints. However, Neanderthals experienced higher brain growth rates during early infancy, leading to larger adult brain sizes without an earlier completion of brain growth. This pattern suggests that Neanderthals had a life history pace similar to, or even slower than that of modern humans. These findings challenge earlier assumptions that Neanderthals matured faster than modern humans, highlighting a complex evolutionary trajectory in hominin development. The research suggests that Neanderthal development was more complex than previously thought. While some early studies suggested Neanderthals matured faster than Homo sapiens, newer evidence shows that their brain growth was slower in childhood and their life history may have been as slow, or even slower, than modern humans. Neanderthal's unique growth pattern likely had a significant impact on their survival, behavior, and adaptation. Here's how. Shorter dental growth, but slower brain growth could mean Neanderthal children depended on adults for longer, much like modern humans. However, they may have had less time for extended childhood learning compared to Homo sapiens. Their brain grew rapidly in infancy, but developed differently from modern humans. Some researchers suggest Neanderthals had excellent memory and problem-solving skills, but possibly less cognitive flexibility than Homo sapiens. This could explain why they were skilled at survival in stable environments, but struggled to adapt to rapid climate changes or competition. A faster growth rate, especially in infancy, meant they needed high-energy diets, likely rich in meat. Their stocky, muscular bodies also required more calories, making them vulnerable to food shortages. Homo sapiens with a slower growth pattern may have been more adaptable to varied diets and resource scarcity. Neanderthals were highly specialized survivors, but their faster early development High energy demands and possible cognitive differences may have contributed to their inability to compete with Homo sapiens in the long run.